The Jell-O Program, back in Hollywood, California, starring Jack Benny with Mary Livingston, Phil Harris, Dennis Day, and yours truly, Don Wilson. The orchestra opens the program with I've Got My Eyes on You. Ladies and gentlemen, when you hear me say Jell-O, here's what I hope you think of. I hope you get a picture in your mind of a swell, gay, colorful dessert. Chuck full of bang-up goodness filled with rich, juicy flavor. Because that's just what the name Jell-O stands for. It means the most delicious, refreshing dessert you ever enjoy. But it means more than that. Because the name Jell-O is a trademark. It's the property of General Foods. And believe me, that trademark is not just a handy name. It's a real responsibility. It means something to be lived up to. So when you buy Jell-O, you know you're getting the finest product possible. And that's why, year in, year out, the makers of Jell-O are making it even better. And it's also why we ask you to insist on Jell-O by name. To be sure of getting the one and only Jell-O, the real thing. So look for those big red letters on the box when you buy. They spell Jell-O, America's favorite gelatin dessert for 40 years and better than ever today. you played by the orchestra. And now, ladies and gentlemen, as you all know, last... The Jell-O program starring Jack Benny with Mary Livingston, Phil Harris, Dennis Day, and yours truly, Don Wilson. The orchestra opens a program with Relax. week, ladies and gentlemen, we receive a number of letters from listeners, many of them saying that Jell-O can't be beat, that it's so delicious it just can't be improved. Well, the makers of Jell-O appreciate that, of course, but all the same, they look at the matter a little differently. For ever since this grand new dessert was first introduced more than 40 years ago, the Jell-O people have been constantly working to improve it, to make those six delicious flavors even more delicious, to make those grand glowing colors even gayer and more festive to make it thriftier to buy and easier to prepare. In other words, to make Jell-O even better than the best. And your thank you to us has been Jell-O's steady growth in popularity. So remember those big red letters on the box spell Jell-O, and Jell-O assures you of the finest enjoyment, rich flavor, and glowing colors, America's favorite gelatin dessert, now better than ever. by the orchestra. And now, ladies and gentlemen, our program tonight will... The Jell-O program starring Jack Benny with Mary Livingston, Phil Harris, Dennis Day, and yours truly, Don Wilson. The orchestra opens the program with How High the Moon. I can tell you how quick and easy Jell-O is to make, and I can tell you how thrifty it is, too. But when it comes to flavor, well, you'll simply have to try Jell-O yourself. A clear, shimmering mold of lime Jell-O will give you the idea in no time at all. You'll be struck first by its brilliant jewel-like color, so gay and inviting. And with your first taste, you'll notice something else, extra-rich flavor, alive with all the tart, tingling goodness of real fresh lime. Yes, friends, Jell-O is a swell, satisfying dessert, no matter how you serve it, no matter which of Jell-O's six delicious flavors you choose. So try some tomorrow. The name Jell-O is printed on each package in big red letters. That's how you can be sure of always getting genuine Jell-O with its grand, extra-rich flavor, now better than ever. <laughs> Moon 
played by the orchestra. And now, ladies and gentlemen, once again we continue with a description of our trip to Yosemite. K-E-L-L-O. The Jell-O program starring Jack Benny with Mary Livingston, Phil Harris, Dennis Day, and yours truly, Don Wilson. The orchestra opens the program with Let's All Sing Together. Did this ever happen to you? The family would sit down to some special dessert, but you weren't allowed to have any. Remember how hurt you felt? Well, that never happens when there's jello for dessert. For jello is marvelously light and wholesome, and the whole family can enjoy it from grandpa on down to junior. And believe me, the whole family does enjoy it. For jello is the perfect ending to any meal. Those six delicious flavors are as delightful and refreshing as the juicy ripe fruit itself. And those six gay colors, as cheerful as a rainbow, make a radiant success of your dessert course. Make it something truly special every time. So treat the family to some jello tomorrow. If you haven't enjoyed it recently, you'll find it even better than you remember. More delicious and inviting, more downright swell. Try it and see. Look for those big red letters on the box. They spell jello, and jello spells an all family treat. <laughs> Let's all sing together, played by the orchestra. Now, ladies and gentlemen, for the last installment of our... Yes, sir, ladies and gentlemen, three weeks ago, when we told you about Jello Orange Vanilla Whip, we really started something. Letters have been coming in every day telling us how much folks have enjoyed this new Jell-O dessert. In fact, it's proved such a big hit that we've decided to give you this swell, easy recipe again for those of you who may have missed it the first time. Here's how it goes. Take one package each of orange Jell-O and Jell-O vanilla pudding and mix them up as you usually do. Then chill the orange Jell-O and whip it as directed on the box. Next, chill the Jell-O vanilla pudding and add to the whipped Jell-O beating constantly until blended. Then mold and you have a grand, inexpensive treat, simply ideal for parties and special occasions. So friends, be sure to try this intriguing new combination of golden orange jello and creamy jello vanilla pudding. It's really different, really delicious, really top. Well, folks, we're on our way home now. This is the last number of the 21st program in the current Jell-O series. And we will be with you again next Sunday night at the same time from Hollywood, California. You know, Mary, it was thrilling being up in Yosemite, wasn't it? Yeah, it was swell. <laughs> what are you laughing at? I'll never forget the expression on your face when you crashed into the ski house. Boy, that was fun. Quiet, Dennis. <laughs> Good night, folks. <laughs>